una persona que dedica mucho tiempo, eh, no hay más que ver que en estos días que va a estar aquí en Valencia, nos dedica una semana a Valencia, va a impartir seis conferencias, cuatro de ellas orientadas a un público muy joven, eh, niños y niñas para motivarles por, por la ciencia y la tecnología, y eso en una persona de su de calidad científico-tecnológica y aparte su, su agenda, es muy de agradecer. Well, of, of course, I'm very happy to be, you know, to have been uh, selected as one of the honoris causa doctors of the university here. Um, well, in, in particular, this university, because I already visited several times, mm -hmm. and um, also because we have a special connection um, between Strasbourg and this university. Mostly thanks to uh, Professor uh, Jiménez Molero. My main mission, I consider, is to promote science, uh, to have contact with uh, as many young people as possible, uh, to show them that science is extremely important. Uh, essential for our societies and that uh, science can be very exciting, that scientists are very often extremely happy to do science, to work. First, let me say that uh, basic science, fundamental science, is at the origin of everything. If you look in your surrounding, If you think of, let's say, medical uh, uh, technologies or uh, computer science, everything at some stage originating from basic science. This being said, it is of course very important to ask ourselves the question which kind of application we may hope for the future or Do we already have applications today uh, which could lead to, uh, let's say, commercial uh, applications? There are several fields uh, which are certainly um, very exciting in terms of um, exploration. Uh, computing or computer sciences based on molecules and something which is very close to being applied is in medicine, having molecular machines in uh, fluids, in biological fluids, in blood. And those machines uh, should be able to transport uh, drugs, uh, molecules having a thera therapeutic effect, to transport them till the target. And the target would be a malignant cell, a cancer cell. The first one, perhaps, is to enjoy what they are doing. If they do not enjoy, you know, if they are not very happy to do science, I would really advise them to do something else. The second message <laughs> um, is to try and acquire um, a lot of knowledge. Um, so they should try to read Uh, many publications to learn, you know, uh, um, very, very seriously um, science in various topics. And the third message is related to the second message. It is to be adventurous. Perhaps instead of working in the same field yeah, for years and years and years, they should not hesitate to jump to some other field to explore new routes uh, and to start new projects in fields which they do not feel very comfortable in. <laughs>